I regret it a lot. <laughs> Why? I, I'm already here, so. The first thing that you have to want it for you to yeah, enjoy it, passion. okay? Yeah, passion. I'm enjoying it. Yeah, it's a nice course. Mm, I can tell you are, you are giving glow. <laughs> Hello, hello, guys, and uh, welcome back to Gift Varsity TV. Uh, this is your host, Gift Pozegana. We are at the University of Johannesburg uh, in Johannesburg, APK campus. I'm with this uh, beautiful lady next to me. Can you introduce yourself? I'm Joy Natasha. What are you studying? Maths and computer science. Maths and computer science, guys. <laughs> and your side? I'm Shailene Reza, and I'm also studying math and computer science. Oh, math and computer science, all of you. Okay, so why did you choose to study math and computer science out of all the courses that are here in the world? Well, if you look at how the world is becoming more like technologically advanced, you see that, okay, there's a need for people who are in this field. So, yeah. Okay, okay. you're interested in technology? Kind of. Kind of. Yeah. Okay, and your side? Uh, I think I am a math lover, so yeah, I like solving problems and all those. And as for computer science, yeah, the world is becoming more technical, as she said. So yeah, I think it is, it's going to really help in future. Okay. Yeah. So you don't regret choosing it? Okay, I regret it a lot. <laughs> Why? I'm already here, so I have to push. So what are the challenges you're coming across as a student? Workforce, it's mm. like a whole lot. Mm. And once you fall behind, there's no going back. Okay. It's just, it's just bad. Just bad. Yeah, yeah it's bad. Yeah. I don't, I don't recommend. Oh, yeah, guys, <laughs> recommend it in the future. Do it, guys. Right? You know, if if you do something that is difficult now, your life will be easier. Okay, but if wait. you do something that is easy, your life will be okay, difficult. Wait. I'm kidding, guys. Okay, wait. Are you are you doing maths and computer? Yeah, no, exactly. But guys, do it. But yeah, yeah it's it's okay. Really okay. Cool. So you don't regret choosing uh, math and computer. I don't because okay besides the the difficulties we have to actually that is why I actually chose math in particular not because I say that is that is, the difficult part is that is the one that I like so solving the problems um, is what I like the best so the more difficult it is the, more, uh, the challenges and stuff that is what I like so yeah I don't uh, I don't regret okay so what are the requirements of studying uh, mathematics and computer science uh, here okay i, I kind of forgot you forgot yeah, yeah. but you need good, good yeah like, but but what i know for for sure is uh it's english english uh you know, if you say should be more than five yeah six yeah yeah and then um math also is important and then mm, and then there's a third one uh, i i've forgotten we applied this asked about physics if you did like physics and those science yeah science type okay subjects. all right all right all right all right so guys for more info with regards to the requirements you need to consult the prospectors go to uj uh, website and ask prospectors. any advice last words for someone who's currently in grade 12 who want to start please be positive <laughs> okay just choose your course wisely and you also have to have a passion for it because if you don't then you'll just end up like you know stranded so yeah okay and aside yeah yeah he have the right reasons to choose the course because like reasons like only money i are, are not are not it because now imagine struggling yeah that's how some of us end up leaving courses and stuff and stuff and that is not a nice thing to do so yeah choose your course wisely guys do proper research thank you so much for your time uh all the best with your studies you. till next time I you can press man. Hello, hello, guys. Uh, welcome back to Gift Varsity TV. We are at the University of Johannesburg in Johannesburg. I'm with a computer science student. Can you introduce yourself? I'll hold All you for right. a uh, My name is uh, MJ. I'm doing a uh, comm science second year. Second year. Yeah. Wow. How is it to start a computer science? <laughs> Yeah, there are some challenges, but overall, I'll say uh, yeah. it's worth it. It's worth it. At yeah. the end. Why did you choose to study computer science? I chose it because uh, growing up, I the thing like for technologies and stuff, computers, and also like like yeah. the career that I'm focusing on. So yeah, I had to do comm science. Yeah. The computer and also, it's like and say like the fourth industrial revolution that's coming up. So yeah, you're preparing so, it. Yeah. 
you are. Yes, people are gonna create this fourth industrial revolution, right? Okay. So, uh, yeah, it's something that you've always wanted. Even in high school, you're like, no, yeah. you're going for computer science. Yeah, it's something that I knew which I wanted because I've seen some people that are to come side, but then the problem is like, like they were forced to put your in and to come side to come side, but then it's like they're not so, hip. Yeah, they're not hip. So, I think the first thing that you have to want it for you to yeah, enjoy it, okay, yeah, passion, make one passion and stuff, stuff like oh, that. Right. So guys, you need to be passionate with computer science because this is not an easy course, right? You know, all these languages, all the coding, <laughs> so it's not easy, it's not easy at all. Okay, so what are the requirements of studying computer science at University of Johannesburg? So uh, you have to have a good math background. Um, if uh, you also like, let's say, um, if you did a uh, CAT or ITH school, that's also um, perfect. But mostly it's like maths and good uh, English marks and stuff. Like also, I don't know, maybe science is like different. And it depends on yourself, but maths and um, uh, English are the most important one. Also, okay. physical science is for some people. Okay, okay, okay. Great, great, great. Any advice for someone who wants to study computer science at University of Johannesburg next year? Yeah, my advice is just like, okay, like be, be prepared to learn. They're like, be hungry to learn like okay also like what i said be passionate about it because if you know what i'm gonna get bored easily and like you know what i'm gonna give up easily yeah. gonna fail <laughs> yeah. I feel okay my brother man all the best with your studies in computer science at uj guys don't forget to like this video and subscribe there's computer science at uj did i ask the requirements okay 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 so guys do it because computer science students are the one who are going to create the fourth industrial revolution. They're going to be a software developer, a software engineer. All companies nowadays, they require computer science uh, graduates, you know, so that they can be there uh, creating a lot of things, you know. Thank you so much for watching. Till next time, Gift Pozekana here, uh, Gift Facility TV. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you. Khalil. Hello, hello, guys. Uh, welcome back to Gift Varsity TV. Uh, this is your host, Gift Pozekana. We are at the University of Johannesburg in Johannesburg. I'm with UJ students here. Hi. Hi. What's your name? You can name. You can name? And Kulego. Kulego. Sandra. Sandra. What are you studying? Uh, become Information System. All of you? Yeah. You're doing the same course? Yes. Why Information System? It just so seemed like something new and it's it has a lot of career opportunities afterwards. Oh, yeah. wow. Yes. Uh, oh, oh, why, why? Yeah. Oh, okay, okay. Um, to be honest, um, I wanted to study computer science, but then the requirements were just crazy. So, become IS is like close to computer science, but then it focuses more on business. Yes, that's why. All right, all right, all right. Yeah, um, become IS is best of both worlds. It's um, business and IT combined. So there's not too much pressure from the IT world or the business world. So yeah, you are able to cope with it. Okay, 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 okay. Hi. So which means uh, you are interested in technology in the future, you know, because usually computer science goes with IS most of the time. Yes, indeed. So how is it to be a student studying IS at Uni Information Systems here at University of Johannesburg? I'm not going to lie, it's very stressful. Yeah. But then it's also fun because you get to learn a lot of other things that you thought you knew, but then you didn't actually know. <laughs> like For me so far, it's been like great because I'm passionate about what I'm studying. So it's just been easy and yeah, I'm enjoying it. Yeah, it's a nice course. I can tell you are, you are even glowing your yeah, head. Yeah, you know. yeah. yeah um, in the beginning it was it was quite stressful, very hectic. Um, I know our lecturer just dove into com like the IT world very quickly. But yeah, now we've um, gotten a hang of it. It's very nice. Okay, okay, okay. So you said you didn't do ComSci because of, I just want to know the requirements now of studying IS so that we can finish up with Um uh, mathematics, I think it's yeah, fifty percent. English, home language, 60, 60 or seventy. Yeah. Yeah. And that's it. Just technical maths. If you do technical maths, you can also do this degree. Okay. 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 Any advice? Last words go before we close for someone who wants to study IS uh, uh, and who are in currently in grade twelve. Ah. Uh, oh. I'll start. Just study hard, dog. Put put in all 
the work effort na na nani just yeah yeah bro just study man work hard you'll be fine Uh, if you're scared of hard work, please don't do this degree. And if you know that you're interested in learning a lot more, this is definitely the degree for you. <laughs> I think also like what she said, um, or what 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 he said, like um, you know, in grade twelve, you think you know all the components. You don't, guys. You really don't. So prepare beforehand. Okay, <laughs> guys. It's possible you can do information systems at University of Johannesburg. Thank you so much for watching. Subscribe guys like this video right like I know to none thank you so much you must be cheap yeah